What is going on guys, Voxel here. In today's video, we will be exploring the new Greenville updates. So, um, right next to me, we have Gabriella. I do not know who they are or remember who they are, but I had them added. And then we have Mersey also. So we're gonna be exploring the update. Um, we're just gonna quickly go over all the stuff and yeah. Starting off the video, we have 14 new cars. This is the mini, that's the new Trackhawk. The only car I bought so far is the Trackhawk, although this mini is nice. I think I will just get the one from the Easter egg hunt, which is another thing they added. So basically, if you get all the parts to this mini, you can get a free Mini Cooper. Next, we are at the new six houses. Basically, this used to be called six houses because there are six houses, well, there were seven houses. But now you can see there's a lot more than seven houses here, as you can see a lot more houses so pretty much half of the session can get houses and the thing i like about this the lake houses are closer to six houses than before and there's just plenty of places also here's the new sign six housand and you have a prop of bar oh that's ivy him tripping prop of ivy right there i don't know barb's character kind of similar look i guess you could say Back to the GV hunt. Basically, if you get all of these parts, you get a free Mini Cooper egg car. Um, so far, I only found the antenna, so I'm a far distance away from getting all the stuff. Yeah, each part gives you $4,000. Also, there's been some changes to lighting and stuff on some car brands, so that's for you to discover. If I do discover any, then I'll make a video on it. One small update, all of your limited cars say limited under them now. So limited, limited, limited. You can see all my limiteds that I have. Um, okay, so now there are new Easter decorations around the dealership. You can not collect these eggs for the mini because you're collecting car parts this year. Happy Easter from the Greenville team. You have some new cars on display. The new Kia K5, the new Toyota Tundra remodel. The new um, Grand Cherokee looks like one of the off-road trims. And you have a EQS in the middle. Um, I think Cade got it to where that car was in the middle. So Drop cars were added. One of the examples are the new uh, Dodge Durango. There's also a new Atlas prop car. Okay, so for the Easter hunt, you cannot have your friends help you out because it's different for everyone but while i was in free cam looking for prop cars i noticed that there was a rear bumper over here waiting on me so i'm gonna see if it's behind here or inside of here so it's inside of here um when i do this egg hunt though i won't use free cam to my advantage that doesn't make it fun i'm gonna go exploring around the map and boom as you see four thousand dollars and i found the rear bumper of the car I'm already here. We're gonna look around a little bit, make sure there's all parts in here. But I feel like I know where some of the parts can be, so I might just head there in just a second. There's nothing. So yeah. As I push my truck down to the park, we are showing you the location to get to the park. Basically, you just want to keep driving straight, keep driving straight. Like basically straight all the way down the highway and you'll eventually see the entrance. Once you start seeing this, that's your indicator to slow down where the entrance is right here. So this is the new Greenville Park called Cats Park, town of Greenville, because also this was modeled by Cat. If you... So here's the entrance. You have these small tight parking spaces if you want, but it can fit my Silverado pretty easily. You just got to park up on the curb a little. There's a little sketch to park here, and with the bad GVRP drivers, you may not want to park exactly right there. Because look, yeah, you got a high chance of getting hit, pretty much. Um, but if you have a smaller car, it should work. Me personally, these spots are nice. Um, this fully fits my truck, and another car can park behind me. But let's explore this new park. As you can see, you got, you got some football fields, uh, or soccer. I call it soccer, but call it football fields. Um, but then you got the actual football field back there, and then an the actual big soccer field back here. So these are little little mini ones, like if kids want to play, but big dogs want to play, you can do that. And you got the football field. Um, 
yeah, you know, I might throw a football at Cade's head or something, but he's got to see. So we got some decoration here. Got an American flag because America. We got our first bench. Now, this is really nice. Uh, I feel like you can drive down here. Yeah, I think you can drive down there. Um, but we're just going to walk around because this is a park. And what do you do at parks? You walk around. You don't drive. Okay, so over here we got some seating areas if you just want to be out in the sun. But if you want to get away from those bees and stuff, you can go under there. Don't forget your bug spray. For your little kids, for your little never minds. Um, what? Well, somebody already got the mini car. So this is what it looks like once it's complete. Um, wow. I'll eventually get it and I'll show it off. But yeah we got that we have these and we also have a slide that literally kills you got some sand more seating but now i'll get back to you guys once we get across the park because it's a lot all right so there appears to be a new prop barn building i've went over there already but it's a prop and there's also a mini part on top of it which i just noticed um it might be different for some people but you get the point we got a soccer field over there and uh, yeah, there's also a new lake for seating, etc. So if you enjoyed today's video, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. 40 new wheels and tires plus, which you can explore, but that's gonna be it.